Member for Vanimo Green, Belden Nama, appeared this morning before two members of the Leadership Tribunal at the Waigani Courthouse. The leader was referred in August over allegations of misconduct in office. Formal introductions, as well as matters concerning how the tribunal was to progress, were discussed before it was adjourned to next Monday. The public prosecutor is expected to officially refer Mr Nama to the tribunal when he presents allegations before a full three-men bench. Maivo Lafanama reports. The courtroom was packed to capacity as opposition leader Don Polier was among the audience who was there to witness the start of the tribunal. Nama was referred on 15 allegations. Top amongst them is the forceful entry into a courtroom in 2011 by Mr. Nama and soldiers who wanted to arrest Chief Justice, says Salomo Injia. Other allegations include failing to lodge financial returns, late submissions of annual statements from 2007 to 2013, interfering with administrative processes, misapplication of funds and purchasing of properties in Samoa, and failure to pay higher bills. While formal introduction and rules expected to be followed were laid down by Chairman Justice Goodwin Poole, several allegations against the leader will not be pursued, says Public Prosecutor Pondros Kalowin. These include allegations of the leader's interference with appointment of a public servant in his district and purchases of properties in Samoa. Lawyer Greg Shepard, representing Nama, says he will raise issues concerning jurisdiction when the tribunal resumes. My vote, Lafanama, NBC National News, Port Moosby.